Well, his angel has been found. A 14-year-old Bemidji area teenager will get to meet the woman who helped save his life following an ATV crash. She slipped away when first responders arrived and didn't realize until recently that he wanted to meet her. Matt Henson has the story. It's a trip around Four-Legged Lake near Leonard that would change Nikki Hughes' life forever. The most horrifying burns I've ever seen. A 14-year-old boy and his friends in desperate need of help after a fiery ATV accident. And when I stepped out, I was terrified. I, I didn't know the extent of his burns or what was all going on. I just knew that he needed my help. One of the boys, Gabe Schwarzlander, was worse than the others. He had sustained life-threatening burns over a third of his body. I just remember him screaming and begging for me to make the pain go away. For 15 minutes, the personal care attendant and mother of three stayed with Gabe and the boys until rescue crews arrived. It seemed like hours, and we just walked and we talked. And he begged me to promise him that it was going to be okay. Once the ambulance was on scene, Nikki Hughes slipped away unnoticed. Gabe would spend the next month in a Twin Cities burn unit. He's home in Bemidji now, but has 18 months of rehab ahead of him. Many nights I've stared at the stars, praying for his recovery, wondering who he was. Exhale through your mouth. This week, that question was answered. We profiled Gabe's story, which included a plea from his family to meet the angel who saved their son's life. Not everybody would have stopped. The woman from Langdon saw the story on social media last night. I started crying. I, I couldn't believe that that little boy that I met that day, never met him before in my life, and the circumstances we met on, that I touched his heart that much. Gabe and Nikki have since connected, and she is looking forward to meeting the boy who has touched her heart forever. To touch a family to that extent, it, it, it melts my heart. It makes me feel good. To me, I, I was just doing something everybody should do. Nikki and Gabe plan to meet next week. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.